Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Go Sweden. Today it's time for the reaction of an unreleased song from Baby Lasagne called Soya, which is a song that he has released before his whole career exploded thanks to the Eurovision Song Contest. And you guys put this song under the comments that I have to listen to it. And based on my reactions to the songs IG Boy and also of course Rim Tim Tagadim, you said that this song might be more my type. So of course I want to check it out. I am now also back after all my vacation from Germany, from Norway. There will be videos about this coming out in the future. I don't know if you have noticed also when you're checking out this video that I will not publish videos on a daily basis now anymore. I want to just try things out, but reactions don't count into this. So right now this video is coming out on Wednesday, but f future reactions just come out when I feel like doing it and of course also when I have the time. But now enough said about this, let's go into Baby Lasagne, or I think it is not really under the, the band name Baby Lasagne, more like under Marco's other former names, I don't know. So let's see what this song is about. The beginning sounds very much like a medieval thing, like a, you know, like an old castle. Okay, I have to say I like the the chorus, the melody, especially like this. But I already said this medieval thing. The verses, however, like right now, they are more focused on the on the lyrics. Not really focused on the music, but now again. By the way, what is this instrument called that's that, that is doing this high note? Or these high notes? Oh no, that's... I like that part as well. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so yeah, from Baby Lasagne. Unfortunately, the quality of this audio was not perfect. Maybe there is a better version than this YouTube version that you guys have linked under the last video. However, still I could get what you mean by saying that this song is more, more likely my type because it is in the chorus and also like in this... What is this at the end? Like the final step before we have the last chorus. The first two verses, they were not really my type because these things always mean that I have to focus on the lyrics. And I'm like a person, if the melody and the rhythm of a song catches me and I want to sing the song along, then I look up the lyrics and then the song can get his full potential. But before that, 
if the song is already trying to tell me, hey, these are the lyrics and they might be important, but I'm not really connecting with the song, then this, is, this feels for me a bit like I'm not ready yet to listen to every single word and try to understand because I'm waiting for the melody, for the rhythm. And so these verses, they were not so good in my opinion, but I can definitely also see the improvements that were made from this song then to IG Boy and Rim Tim Tagedim. But still a good song. Unfortunately, like I said, the quality is not that good. Taking a lot away from this feeling, the melody. Yeah, but that is my opinion on this song. Thank you very much for recommending it. I like it and maybe, but I don't think so, we will have a real version of this song, clean, perfect quality on Spotify or whatever, that would be awesome because then I would definitely give this song a good chance to build more connection with me. But that is it for today. What do you guys think about the song? If you had to rank the songs from Marco, Baby Lasagna, whatever, would this be your number one or would this be more like on number three, number four? I don't know. Feel free to write down anything in the comments. I'm also very happy to check out any other recommendations that you have from Baby Lasagna, other songs. Of course, I, I have also seen that you were putting this festival thing in the comments. But if I understood correct, this was more like spoiling future songs that he is releasing. And I'm not really looking into too much of this live things before the real deal. And of course the Eurovision Song Contest did something different, but I'm more looking for the, yeah, the clean stuff right now because we are not looking into this vocal stuff like it is in the yeah, Eurovision Song Contest. But again, thank you very much. I hope you had a wonderful day. We're going to see each other back in the next video. Until then, have a good day. Bye-bye.